So now let's see how rollover captions work inside of Adobe Captivate. So to work with rollover captions, I'm going to first bring in an image. So I'm going to go to image and bring in an image right over here. So let's bring in this image right over here. So what I want to do is I want to have rollover captions. That is whenever I point over somewhere, I want caption to pop up. So that is what rollover caption is all about. So I'm just going to go around into object right over here where it says rollover caption. So let me just click on this and then a box will pop up. This box is the rollover area. Let's say, for example, this is where I want to roll over. And as I roll over there, it says that this is, let's say, the tallest building or something. So I'm just going to go around here and type in tallest building right over here. And I'm going to select it and change the color just like this and arrange this out over here. So let me just arrange this uh, text box out. So let me just resize it and keep it over here. So this is the tallest building. I'm going to have another rollover area as well. So I'm just going to go around and I'm going to go to rollover caption. Another box area appears. So I'm just going to bring this on over here and I'm going to say something like old building. So I'm just going to go around and say old building right over here. I'm going to select this and then I'm going to select white color just like that. And I'm going to go around uh, a side and then resize this out just like this and drag it around over here. And this is how uh, this works out. So you got the tall building and you got the old building. So now I'm going to preview the project. So I'm going to go to preview right over here and I'm going to go to project. And once I do that, let's see what happens now. If I were to press the play button, you can see that there's the rollover area. And as I roll over, you see the tallest building and you see the old building right over here, just like that. You still see the boxes, but if you want to make them completely transparent, you can select both of them out right over here and I'm going to keep the opacity as zero, as you can see right over there. Also, uh, the stroke width is going to be zero, so it is invisible, just like that. So I'm just going to go on to preview, preview the project right over here. And once I preview the project out, you'll be able to see that as I hover over, there's the tallest building right over here, and there's the old building, as you can see. And that is how you can use rollover captions inside of Adobe Captivate. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.